There's three. He looks big. Hang on. He's big. He's a legendary. Oh my god. G'day everyone and welcome back to Call of the Wild. We're here today on Vahonga Savannah and as you can see in my hands, I have a muzzleloader. We're going on a muzzleloader hunt. Of course, we've got 300 with us as well, just in case we do come into any big Cape Buffalo, because there's no ammo that's big enough to take down the Cape Buffalo. But, yeah, we're just going to go for a bit of fun, a bit of a shot, and see if we can try it out. I've never even used the muzzle loader before, so this is brand new to me. As always, guys, if you do find yourself enjoying the video, please consider liking and subscribing. I would really appreciate that. Also, if you'd like to follow me on my social medias, my TikTok and Instagram are on the screen right now. We've got a really good community over there, and that's where I choose the topics of most of the hunts. So, anyway, without further ado, we'll get straight into it, and hopefully get some big trophies. Going to be a nice test of skill to start us off here. We've got a nice level 4 beige gem spock over here, about 100 metres out. So, it does have the option to zero for that, and I reckon we're going to take it. So, first ever animal with the, with the muzzle loader. Haven't tried it before. See how we go. When he pops his head up. Oh, I think that's good. Jeez, he's going down really quite quickly too. That's good. Oh, I wish it had a faster loading time, but hey, one shot is all you need. There he is there, only a silver. And I am blind as hell, because I thought it was beige, but it's only a dark. But anyway, nice double lung shot. That penetration is pretty much straight through to the other side. I'm locking this muzzle loader already. Just want to try a bit of a longer shot here just to see the capabilities of this thing. It's about 229 meters out on a Gems box, so it's pretty much the biggest that this gun will take down. I'm hoping that when it puts its head up, just want to see what the penetration's like over the distance. We did hit it. And it is going down too. Going down rather quickly. We'll go over and have a look, but. I'm really impressed with this. Very accurate and very powerful by the looks of things. Here he is, right there. He didn't go very far. Okay, 230 meters out. Still managed to reach double lung. I only just missed the heart. But almost still went straight through. So I'm really, really impressed with the accuracy and the penetration of this muzzle loader. I'm really enjoying hunting with this today, actually. So I just heard a random call from a springbok, and I did put out a couple calls, and it turns out it's just this little. There's a little guy here, level 3 male, and I thought it might give us a decent chance to try out the round ball ammo for this one. So if we just quickly switch over, plonk that in there, get a quick range and give it a crack. They're made of paper, these things, so they're pretty easy to take out. On 50, shouldn't be too difficult. Zoom in. That should have been good. I can't see because of the smoke. <laughs> but I would say... Yep, that piled her up straight away. Beautiful. That's exactly what we like to see. Ah, there we go. I saw the blood and I couldn't see the animal. Yeah, <laughs> dickhead. Alright, just a little silver. Right lung, left lung and the heart. It doesn't get much better than that, does it, guys? That right there is really quite a nice level 4 kudu. On the move there, starting to go attentive. So... Oh, I forgot to reload. Just hang with me. Hang with me for the next 10 minutes while I reload this guy. 20 years later, that's finally reloaded. Anyway. Should be able to get that in there. Beautiful. Dropped on the spot. Let's go for squeeze. I reckon that was a nice hard shot. Nice double lung shot. 127 meters out. Really quite a nice gold, gold lesser kudu. Okay, so a guy over on me TikTok, uh, he thought it was a good idea to try and pick a fight with a Cape Buffalo with the muzzleloader. I personally think that's a death wish, but hey, as I do love all you guys, I'm going to try and do it. I'll probably die, but why not give it a go and see if we can maybe survive. Probably very unlikely, but... I guess we'll give it a crack. Okay, mate, this is what you wanted, and you got it. So, I'd say, simply, the trick is to not miss. And 
that was vital blood. Hopefully it'll go down quickly. And yeah, there you go. So obviously, if you hit it, it's not too bad. But I can 100% see how it'll be a big panic if you didn't hit your shot. Is it a bloody giant war dog over here? He's only level four. And I can't seem to spot it, but it's got a max estimate of 52. It is that one that's just over the top there, right there. So, gonna try and get a bit closer and take him down because he's really nice. There he is, there, just straight ahead. It's front on, which I don't really like at all. But we're gonna zero for 100. That way, if we get a shot, we can have a crack straight away. Actually, we might be able to slot a lung in there. We'll see. Well, we dropped him, and I reckon that's just gone behind the head. So, with any luck, we should have a decent Warthog trophy there. Okie dokes. Let's see the damage. It's a 49.3 gold. Nice. And that just ripped straight through him. Holy moly. Left lung, liver, stomach. Straight through. The penetration on this thing is unbelievable. That's awesome. I think we're going to chuck him in the lodge. Just to get one up on a plaque. That's exactly what we want. That is a big mythical lion. If we can take that out with a muzzle loader, I'm going to be a very, very happy man. It looks darker for some reason. I think it's just the shade. Anyway, 94 meters out. Hoping. Don't run away. Give me a shot. That should be good. Did we get? Yes, we got lungs. Good stuff. I was really worried about stuffing that up. I reckon we just got ourselves a nice addition to the lodge. Lighting's not the best and Hunter's certainly not happy, but what a nice photo. That is a big, big lion. All right, let's have a look. Oh, I'm super happy about this. Oh no. Oh no, I forgot they're a class nine. I thought they were class 8. I completely flunked that. 46.6. It is a gold. It would have been a gold. Bloody hell. Oh, well. Hey. It is a muzzleloader hunt. All right. It is a muzzleloader hunt. It is what it is. That's all right. I'm not even mad, all right. I'm not going to put it in the lodge because of the score. But, hey, I'm not mad. It's all right. Alright, so we're doing something I don't usually do, and that's jumping into multiplayer to see what's on offer around everyone else's maps. Um, it's currently Lion, the end of Lion drink time, and about to be the start of Springbok drink time. So, we are going to have a look and chase some of those species, I guess, and see what we can find. That there is a really nice Warthog. Four, easy, 46 to 55, which is pretty big. It's bigger than the one we got earlier. It's 220 meters out. It's gonna be pushing our limits, but I reckon we can have a fair crack. If he'll stop walking, which I don't think he will, so we might have to lead him a little bit. Aim a little high when he slows down. Maybe not. Oh my god. <laughs> I don't know what we hit, but it seemed like it was good. That's either gonna be terrible and be brain, or be perfect, and be heart, or double lung. I'm hoping what we hit wasn't brain, but even if it was, I mean, not a bad shot with a muzzle loader from over 200 meters out. No, it was double lung, perfect, straight through the center. That's exactly what I wanted. Holy moly, look at that. Look at the tusks on that thing. That is awesome. That is super cool. Oh, looks like we're about to have another dance with a buffalo. That wasn't as good of a shot as before, so maybe we might have a bit more trouble with this one. And we got two coming. Okay, now we're in trouble. Now I see what you meant. Okie doke. Is he aggressive as well? If so, we're stuffed. I'll try and get you. Oh no. There's three. He looks big. Hang on. He's big. He's a legendary. Oh my god. 
Oh my god. What's that? Oh. That's bottle blood. Yes. Oh my god. If we get a diamond out of this. Holy moly. Okay, he's down. And. Alright. I am dumbfounded. I looked everywhere around here and I did not see that legendary anywhere. I saw those horns and I was like, holy moly, they are huge. We're gonna ditch the muzzle loader. We've got more important things on our plate at the moment. Okay. Reload. Sorry, I'm all over the place at the moment. That just took me by surprise. Holy cow. Okay. Alright. Just quickly, I'll quickly pick these up and I'll meet you back at this time. Alright, here we are. Fingers crossed we can claim it. Woo! Okay. Let's have a look. It is a diamond, guys! It is a diamond. 152. It is a point over and it's a nice grey. Holy moly, look at those horns. Oh, that is insane. That was just a surprise. I did not know that thing was even around. Holy moly, that just made my night. Okay, we're putting him straight in the lodge. We are heading back there right now to have a look straight away. Holy cow. Oh, I can't believe it. Wow. Jeez, we're lucky we got it when we did. <laughs> we were just kicked. Oh, we were just kicked. Thank God, that was so lucky. Okay, here we are. Bloody hell, that was just... In five minutes, the whole night just changed. That is insane. Oh, I could not be happier with that. Holy moly. There he is there. Big 152.9 trophy diamond cape buffalo. Holy moly. It does not get any better than that. Alrighty, guys. We're going to wrap it up there. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I will see you all in the next video. Cheers.